What's up guys, Zaf here back with some more Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes action and today we're going to have a look at the Phase 2 and Phase 3 of the Tier 6 AAT and um, I I've never actually used the escape mechanic uh, mechanism before but today I'll be using it uh, because uh, we're lucky enough to enter just as we're about to enter Phase 3 there's about 3 or 2, two or 3% left so I'll be using the same team that I used for the phase one, and um, th I think I posted two hundred over thousand today, about one hundred seventy thousand from the phase two entry, and about a hundred plus thousand from the phase three entry. But never mind, just 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 look at it. Um. So here we don't have General Grievous. We only have the tank. I saw how the other videos on YouTube where they use um, Princess Zodi, which is a Zeta Cody with uh, Echo 5's Clone, face, uh, Clone Sergeant Phase 1 and uh, Princess Leia. It's a pretty cool team. Unfortunately, I don't have those guys yet. So, I can only work with what I have. Uh, since this is tier 6, that means uh, it requires me to have 6 stars minimum to use. And fortunately, I only have a handful of 6 stars because I've just been playing this game for about a month now. Yeah, it's been about exactly one year since I've played, since I've started playing. So yeah, my strap is the same. Um, I'm just gonna go in and hope for Annihilate to come up and just uh, hit the tank with Annihilate. And uh, I was discussing with my guild members and you know, they said that they need more people to do phase 1 and phase 3 for AAT and they're like, since I have a savage and uh, I should be getting to level 80 next month or so or within the next couple of weeks I should try and give my Zeta to savage hopefully if I do get Zeta by then, you know because I'm working on my dark side ship still and I watched some videos and I saw that um, Savage does Phase 1 and Phase 2 much better than Kylo does it. Like it, it's a more consistent run. But that would mean I would also require, it would also mean that I need to have him above 30k health. It's about uh, where G11 will take you, G10, G11, something like that. So yeah, I think uh, I'll start doing something like that. And uh, yeah, Nihilus just used Annihilate. Uh, it went down by about 0.4 something percent of the tank itself. And as you can see from my guild chat, uh, lying down there, it's like phase complete phase 2 of tank takedown. So I'm like, oh, alright, uh, this the phase is complete, I think we should try and retreat sometime soon. But I didn't hit me when I was doing this, you know, I was still <laughs> I was just still trying to hit the tank. Then when when Rex here dies soon. Rex is about to die soon. And I'm like, uh, I saw those videos, they retreated. Shouldn't I try retreating now? I think uh, Rex gets taken out soon. Yeah, I'm I'm I actually tried commenting over the footage. But there were so many gaps in between, I'm like, yeah, I think I'll just re-record it after Twitch and just post uh, audio on top of it, you know? It's much better that way. <coughs> so yeah, about me being selfless for the guild, Savage, I think it's a great plan. In the meantime, I can still use it because he has a high health pool and protection. So I think this is where I try retreating. Is it? Hmm. I think this way it hit me and I'm like, yeah, I should try escaping. Escaping, sorry, not retreating. Escaping. Right? So, yeah, uh, that's how you escape. You hit that thing above the character. So, we managed to escape with both Boba, uh, Boba Fett and Nihilus, but you have a 50% chance to fail. And there it is. Lando failed to escape and he died. So 174,000 damage here, which was about how much exactly we posted in phase one. But phase one was much shorter, I think. So 
I definitely need to build better guys around Nihilus. I don't know. I mean, right now is he's the shortcut to build into getting some damage because I'm I'm actually posting damage equivalent to some level 85s in my guild, and I think that's quite alright. Because I need I need the tokens etc. And uh, my guild's like um, trying to do the heroic AAT soon. They said in about a month or so they'll be doing it. So yeah, now it's just pre heroic AAT. It's just tier six. Can't wait to get those uh, General Kenobi shards. So yeah. That's, uh, I think that's about it as update goes. This is the phase three. Um, it's all droids. So we got the um, B1 battle droids. The Roger Roger guys, right? Yeah. B2 rocket trooper. We land the Nihilid here. Goes down just a bit, but Nihilus just dies straight away. So, phase 3 this is where Savage is. Where, this is where I'm supposed to use Savage. Well, my Savage right now can't be used because he's only 4 star with 13 and 75, uh, 65 shots to go to 5 star. Um, but I've already gotten my Kamen from, from Arena shot, so I should be making Savage of this. I think that's the end of the run. I know, if, if you guys can comment and leave me suggestions on what to do, what to build some more uh, extra for prepping for the AAT, that'd be great to know. Because I've been I've been reading stuff online and they're like, um, they use Zeta Vader, they use a uh, Jedi team for Phase 1, etc. But I really have no idea. So 117 here, plus the 170 earlier. So that's about almost 300, which is not bad. So there, I post 765,690 throughout these first two phases. So that's all for today. This is Zaf, I'm signing out.